In this video, I'm going to lay out for you the Evil Tester free, simple, eight-step guide to learning how to automate a web browser using Selenium. I'll reveal the sources of information that you can use, and yes, I will promote my book. I see the same questions asked on social network sites and forums every few days. How can I learn Selenium? How do I use Selenium? What should I read? How do I get started with Selenium? I want the answers, please do the needful. For some reason, the previous answers don't stick, or people can't find them, or maybe they don't look for them or something. I don't know. But a lot of people have tried very hard to make Selenium very easy to get into, and to help you get started. So if you're prepared to put the work in, the answers are out there. Just don't expect someone to magically drop the information into your brain. You have to put the work in to follow the learning steps. If you're prepared to do that, then the pointers in this video will help you. First, learn a bit about Selenium. So start with the basics. Research what the tool sets out to do. Visit the official site and have a look around at seleniumhq.org. Follow and read the Learn Selenium links. The official Selenium site has tried to make it easy for you. Read the documentation. Go to seleniumhq.org slash docs. If you need or want more than the official documentation, you can read two books. I wrote Selenium Simplified. That's mine. Dave Burns wrote Selenium 1.0 Testing Tools, The Beginner's Guide. You can buy these books. So how do you know which one is right for you? Well, I wrote a comparative review of them here. eviltester.com slash go slash compare. The official documentation might work for you. The Selenium team have done a great job on it. These books go beyond the official documentation and add additional value with in-depth tutorials, more examples and more code samples. And if you think that Selenium is open source, learning should be free too. Well, that's okay. That's why the books have free previews. And these are big previews. Last time I checked, the Selenium Simplified preview is 75 pages of free Selenium tutorial goodness. Go look for yourself. eviltester.com slash go slash compare. This page has links to the tables of contents and the previews. In the Selenium Simplified preview, you'll get the full chapter one overview of the tools you'll need. You'll get the full chapter two overview of the Selenium IDE and how to use it. You get the full chapter three and chapter four so you can install Java and run the Selenium RC server. And the full chapter five and chapter six to allow you to create JUnit tests from the Selenium IDE and into the Eclipse Java IDE. I can't believe I gave so much away. You get the full chapter 21 on how to start the Selenium RC server from your test code. And the full chapter 38 with additional reading links and learning tips. And a summary reference of the API. For some training courses, that would be day one. It's in the free preview. Or you can search for blog posts on how to start. Here are a few searches to try. Search for Selenium Steps blog. Selenium Get Started blog, Selenium Tutorial blog, and let's not forget the official seleniumhq.org site. There's a lot of information out there, just a search away. Some of it will be out of date. The blogs will repeat and overlap. They will not be presented in a consistent style. But you can get a lot of information you need without buying the books if that's the learning style you prefer. Where can you get help when you start learning? The official site has a page all about that seleniumhq.org slash support. Read the Selenium forums, the Google group. Join LinkedIn groups. It seems like there's about a million groups on the topic of Selenium and automation and people trying to help each other. Search stackexchange.com for specific answers. The bigger point though is not where, but how you use that help. Don't ask generic questions. Ask good specific questions. Show the source code you were using when you got stuck. Make sure you're learning how to debug the scripts and have investigated it as far as your knowledge will take you. And if that wasn't enough to read, I'm going to give you one more link. seleniumhq.wordpress.com Adam Goucher does a great job scanning blogs, looking for material in Selenium for his smattering of Selenium updates. 
So follow up the links he gives. That will take you to more blogs. Read those blogs. Subscribe to those in your RSS feed. But you might hate reading. That's why you're watching this video. Fine. There are plenty of videos out there. Use Google to search for them. Search for Selenium Automation. You even get some foreign language videos in there. Search for Selenium Testing. Search for Selenium Conference and you'll find the 2011 conference videos and all the GTAC videos. If that all sounds like hard work, then yes, you have to put the effort in. People have put the information out there. Myself and plenty of others have written tutorials. You choose the learning style that works for you and start working through those tutorials. And if you get stuck, Remember, there are two books which aim to help you learn Selenium. I wrote Selenium Simplified for the very reason that people do get stuck. So it provides step-by-step -step instructions for getting you unstuck and productive in Selenium. Right now, just start following the eight steps. Read the official documentation. Start trying to use Selenium using the documentation to help you. Investigate the books available. Use the previews to get started. Auto-generate scripts from the IDE. Use Google to find tutorials, blogs and videos. Use Stack Exchange, LinkedIn and Selenium forums for more specific help. Read through the old issues of a smattering of Selenium. And if you get stuck and can't make progress, then buy one of the books. You can apply this step at any time. If you want all the links and tips in this video in a form that you can read and click on, then visit eviltester.com slash go slash help me. And the next move is yours. And if you put the time in, you can learn Selenium.